Hello everyone. Huh? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Natalie. If you are new here, welcome. Welcome to my channel. Yeah. Today I'm going to make something called gato in Togo. Very, very easy, but very tasty and nice. So I have one full uh, blended onions here. I have garlic, like one spoon. I have one Maggi cube for seasoning. Uh, one teaspoon, teaspoon of salt one teaspoon of sugar one half cup of oil but you can omit it with, with butter if you like. For me, I prefer oil. That's what my mom taught me. So, I prefer oil. One and a half warm water. Yeah. And seven grams of yeast. And three cup of plain flour. And I will go in with my hand. Uh, sorry, I added uh, another one cup. So it's four plain flour. Four cup of plain flour. and five cup of plain flour you don't want it too soft we don't want it too hard to i think five is enough because i forgot to count the oil the water i use for the blended onions yeah this is the perfect texture i want Let me taste this salt. Yes, okay. We cover it and let it rest for five minutes. Then I start prepping the a tray. I'm going to cut them in. On the tray, we just sprinkle some flour on it so that the dough will not be sticky. It will not stick on the trays. Second one too. Yeah. 
just grab the dough like this. Let me have some flour in here. So that I'll be putting my fingers in because the dough is very, very soft. Let's cut it like this. And just trying to mold it in a round shape somehow like this the size is up to you because it's going to double the size later so the size is up to you the end result very fluffy but crisp, crispy at the same time and yummy mm -hmm.
this is the last one you hold it like this you tap it tap it tap it and drop it so be careful 